Now look, anytime you hear me in the afternoon sounding elated, you know that something special, something fresh, something extra, extra cool is going down and Godfrey Okoye University is always breaking into new frontiers. First it was the Godfrey Okoye University Radio and we celebrated the arrival in 2014 and uh, another idea has been birthed and I'm not going to let the cat out of the bag. I will let the the man with the vision to tell us exactly what has happened and uh, where we are going from here. My name is Alex Oboro and I have in the studio the university's management here, led by the Vice Chancellor of Godfrey Okoye University, Very Reverend Father Professor Christian Anyeke. Good afternoon to you, Prof, and uh, welcome to a special interview session here. You are smiling from ear to ear with a paper in your hand. So why are we here and happy? Well, thank you, Alex. Uh, recall that when we got our license for the radio uh, during the celebration of the license, I said we were not going to stop there, that we would go a little higher than having a radio. And uh, this is exactly what's happening today. Uh, two days ago, I received a message from the National Broadcasting Commission that uh, our request for a television license has been approved. And today I have this paper in my hand, provisional approval of application for a grant of direct satellite broadcasting TV license for Godfrey Co University. I just want to announce that our university has got a license to have its own television. So uh, where do we go from here? Because really, uh, television is like having uh, a double fold of a radio. Uh, it comes with a complement of video. So it's more expensive. It also uh, involves a few other things. Uh, you are rubbing at your head, which uh, tells me you have a plan already for that. Well, you can't begin to apply, uh, to apply for something when you have no plan to begin it. Uh, when we said we wanted to have a television, we knew we were going to uh, be able to fund it. Uh, you see, it's one thing to have a dream, another thing is to begin to plan how you can actually uh, realize your dream. I knew when we were applying that we would be able to uh, have um, fund a television. And this one is unlike the radio that's limited, this is not limited, and this is visual, and it's going to offer us a lot of opportunities to do quite a good number of things. It is actually something spectacular because this is the second university in Nigeria to have this license. The first one, the University of Lagos, and we are the second in the whole of Nigeria oh to have this kind of license. So, being the second university to have this license also confers on you some kind of uh, position. Uh, well, someone will say it's not been contested for, but there is a reason why out of all the universities in Nigeria, we are the second to really think it's necessary to get a television. So this also goes into the vision of the university, isn't it, Prof? Yes, I think so. I mean, recall that uh, you know, we apply for radio and NBC has been monitoring our radio. In 2016, we became the best campus radio. These records are there. And the fact that we have not breached any law of the NBC also uh, uh, speaks for us. So when you do something where it opens the door for another thing, I think there's so much trust on the part of the NBC that we can get it right. That's why uh, we are getting And uh, like I said, it opens a lot of doors for the university. You can use it to teach. You can use it to link your partners to teach on the television. You can use it to reach quite a good number of people. So it's quite uh, enormous what we are going to do with this opportunity we have. Well, this is yet another uh, groundbreaking opportunity for students of mass communication because, uh, fine, th there is a demonstration studio where they can do their photographic works, but this time you have a license to have your own television that will transmit to audiences in different parts of Nigeria. So, I mean, what will be going through the minds of maybe would-be students who uh, trying to decide whether to come here for uh, mass communication, which you've mentioned before, has the possibility of becoming a faculty on yes, its own. I believe that anybody who is serious in mass communication now must be looking for Godfrey Okoye University. I do not know any university in this country that is so positioned for this program as we are. We have our radio, we have our television now, and we have all the best hands actually teaching the students. So I think if somebody says, I want to do mass comm, and the person is not considering Godfrey Okoye University, 
he or she may not be a serious person. This is a place where those who want to do mass communication must be rushing now. I expect the program to stop admitting very soon because the rush will be quite heavy. Mm, absolutely. Yeah, yeah. Uh, finally, before I let yeah. you go, uh, Prof, uh, it is, uh, you've, we've got under provisional license, so where do we go from here now? We, go, we are going to start planning. We have two years to set up, set it up as NBC directed. You have got, we've got a license. So within the next two years, we should actually uh, be uh, showing things. Some other, this. So the first consideration is where we're going to put up the, the, the distance, the TV, and then we'll begin to recruit those who actually uh, work there because we need professionals. It's not like the radio, it needs some technicalities and all that. We do the planning and ensure that within the next uh, one year we actually come on air. That's actually the most important, the most important thing now. Uh, training of those who work there will be priority number one and then infrastructure. Because of you, of course you know me, it wouldn't take us much time to set up the infrastructure that is needed for the television. But the crew, those who work there, will be properly trained so that we we'll get exactly what we want out of it. I also look forward to linking the radio and the television. It is now possible in the modern world to have radio and television working together. They have, they, having a radio is an advantage to us. We tr simply have to link the two so that some programs of the radio can also be shown on the television. These things will be happening and that will make us quite outstanding. I'm sure that uh, members of the university management who are here with you, I can see the, uh, the bossa, the, uh, the librarian, the director of uh, ethics and uh, the director of academic planning. We also have, oh, the registrar is here. There's a lot of people in the studio. Uh, but, um, <laughs> uh, yes. So I, I'm sure maybe someone has a question or two. Uh, I mean, if you have a question, feel free to ask it real quick. Or something to say. Or something just... to say, really. Uh, sir, you have a, any question or yes. anything to say? Yes, just to Dr. say kudos. Dr. Nazi, NSN, the registrar. Yeah, kudos to my vice chancellor, who is always uh, trying to go the extra mile to put our university in the lead. He has done it again, just like he used to do. And like he said, people should watch out for this uh, program in, in television. So I wish him all the best, and I wish the university many more heights. Amen. Thank you very much. Thank you, thank you so much. Thank you. We have okay, uh, Reverend Father Doctor Kichukwani. Yes, um, I want us, all of us here and the people listening to us to know the special position we have in our country today, having a radio, having a television. This is a Catholic university. You know the media has been often accused of a lot of falsehood. We are running a media that stands for the truth, for ethical values, and that is an advantage. So when the VC said, if you want to do mass come and you are very serious, you are a serious person, come to this place, that's what it means. Being serious is being also serious for the truth, so that people will not be misguided in our country. So that gives us an edge. We are a Catholic university and we have responsibility for the truth, to tell the society the truth, that is the truth that would set us free and help us to develop properly. That is why I'm very happy that we can now run the television so that people who don't like radios or like to hear and see will also take that opportunity to see how the mass media also, television can be run properly. Thank mm. you very much. Thank you so much, Reverend Father Dr. Kech Wan, the Director of uh, Ethics and Research Administration, Godfrey Okoye University. Uh, okay, uh, maybe we don't have any other uh, uh, comments. Okay, you, please, Jude, please go ahead, please. Jude is one of our reporters. Jude Ezike. Uh, Professor Christian Lenke, the Vice Chancellor, I, I want to say a very big congratulations for this giant strike. But my question is this within the first one year of our broadcast on the radio, we were able to eat the best campus radio station. So what is the plan? Are we going to compete with uh, other TV stations to also compete as in favor with them? What's the, what's the plan now? You know, by principle, uh, if you have the capacity to get a first class, why do you want to get a 2-1? That's my principle, okay? So if you have the capacity to be the best, why do you want to take the second position? So what we have done in the radio will be done in the television. We know the best televisions will have a run. There will be our role models. You know, when you come to do, you talk about channel, you talk about CNN and all that, BBC and all those. Those. Uh, so we have to be watching these ones 
just like we are doing in our radio and uh, trying to Im imitate what I'm doing and trying to trying to excel. Uh, it may not be quite easy, of course, because we are new. But uh, it's always very important to watch all that and see where you have your strong points and, and, and your selling points and then capitalize on the selling points. I have no doubt that again we are going to be named one of the best, if not the best, television in Nigeria in no distant time. Yes, believe, mm -hmm. just believe it. Mm -hmm. okay. Sister. Yes. <laughs> <laughs> I want to congratulate my VC. He has done it again. Yeah. And you see, uh, people have been hearing my voice on radio uh, for admission issues. Mm. Now I'm happy I'm going to appear on TV. Sure. Yes. <laughs> <laughs> claiming, claiming students that God is sending to this university. Yes. Congratulations, my Thank, Thank you so much, uh, Sister <laughs> Dr. Mary Sylvia Mwachuku. You may invite an alumnus of the university to yes, say what he thinks about this great uh, please. Uh, news. Can you just tell us your name? And yeah, I'm um, Mr. Alfonso Soyachana Mwafo. I'm an alumni student of um, Gofre Koyo University, Political Science Education. I'm presently student Gofre Koyo University postgraduate, majoring in Political Science, and my course is Human Security and Counterterrorism Studies. I wish to congratulate my VC and my school as well for climbing the better edge. At least having the television makes me, I have to be very, very happy. When I go out, I have to advertise this is my university. The best and the first to own a television or the second in Nigeria, just like the VC said. Thank you so much, Mr. V um, our VC. And I hope I'm by this October, this will be filled with a whole lot, lot of mass communication students mm. who will always be first class students. Because if you have the capacity to be the first class, why go for the second? Repeating what my VC said. Thank Absolutely. you so much. Thank you so much. Eric? Eric, are you going to sing us out? Yeah, definitely. I'm going to sing. Eric <laughs> That's why I'm signed for. Eric yeah. Beza is here. Eric, good afternoon. So Thank how you, do you feel today? I feel better because I have a guy who already know what is happening. In this <laughs> and because of the way he was doing it, I like it. The Vice Chancellor is a young man who knows the real thing and is doing the right thing, Jonathan. Now, today, he has announced for us that we have a uni um, university television. I am proud to be a member of this university. In any case, my work is to sing and thank God for him mm. and for the university. So maybe we should sing something. something. Yes. When I am down and all oh, my soul so weary, when trouble come, on my heart bored and weak. When I am still and waiting in the silence, until you come and I sit a while with me, you raise me up when I am on your shoulders. You raise us up and more and more and be. We are strong when we are on your shoulder. You raise us up more than we can be. Thank you. Thank you. Professor Emmanuel, I did not want to say something. Guys, yeah, just uh, by way of uh, a note of warning, because it is not easy to get this type of uh, facility in any university. This is number two. And it poses a challenge to us a challenge to live up to it. If the television is here and we are not coming up to it, it will be very bad. So my thinking is that the VC hasn't done his own part. We should be ready to do all that is necessary, appear on the television from time to time and tell the world what we are up to. Because not many people, in fact, when you see or when you hear, you know. 
But when you see, hear and see, you understand. I think this is the time people will begin to understand God to require them more. And so we are saying our leader is on the move. It is good for us to follow up. Congratulations. Thank you, Thank you, Thank you so much. Thank you so much. Okay, yes, the Borsa, Mrs. Uh, Modesta Egi, wants to say something. Yes, I, I want to congratulate the Vice Chancellor of Godfrey Okoye University, Reverend Father Professor Dr. Christian Aneke. Of this, it's not easy at all. And also to congratulate each and every one of us the management, the students. You know, we've been getting it right in this university. And now it's another opportunity to show the world that we are also going to get it right. And I don't have any fear. I don't entertain any fear at all. We are going to get it right once more. So what I will tell our listeners now is to just watch this space. That's mm. my congratulations once more. Yeah, thank, thank you. you. Thank you so much. Yeah, the librarian of the university is here, Mrs. Mary Ellen Chijoke. Well, I think listeners can hear that this room is full of joy. <laughs> it's the most relaxed time I've ever seen in this studio. Um, and it, it reflects just how happy everybody is. Um, the senior management accompanied the vice chancellor to Nsuka on uh, Wednesday for a series of events. And between events, he was checking his email, and suddenly his concentrated um, expression turned into beams of smile, and he started passing his iPad around saying, see what I just got! <laughs> so that's when I first congratulated him, but I'll do it again. <laughs> Congratulations, thank sir. You, thank, you. <laughs> thank you. Thank you so much. Uh, the PRO, you should say a word. Mm. Where is the Patrick or you say a word. Uh, well, I think I'm overwhelmed with joy in the first place. Uh, I think I have to express my gratitude to God for what is happening here. Uh, like we have some of the acronyms as God's own university. And I can always attribute all that is happening here to the miraculous hand work of God. Because if not God, all we are celebrating may not be possible. And since we now know that we are building on the rock of ages, we keep on doing the right thing we have been doing and for which we are known. Uh, our name is a household word now in both tertiary institutions and in the media, because I also work in the media by my extension and contact with people. Whenever I talk about Godfrey Co University, they say, oh, the name that rings bell. So I think this is another avenue now where our bell will echo and wider and reach to the unreached. Uh, dimensions through the television. So I'm really very happy that it has happened and I still rely on God's mercy to sustain us, to give us the expert hands, the grace and the commitment to make it excel, just like the radio is doing. So I, I congratulate the Vice Chancellor. I also was in the team at the University of Nigeria tour and I really even enjoy the news before others. <laughs> I, I enjoy it, so it's a, it's a still news for me now, but I, I simply have to re-echo it. Yes, but I'm really happy that something great is happening and I'm very proud to be here. Yeah. Congratulations. Thank you. Vice Thank, Chancellor. You. Thank you. Thank you so much. And uh, for someone like me, the news is absolute good music for my ears because I have television background from my days in ETV. So it's absolute, uh, really, really wonderful news for me. So I have to congratulate the Vice Chancellor because I know if you have uh, the, a little brief about the NBC and the process of licensing, you will understand that it's not, it's not just like posting a letter and receiving a reply. There are processes that you have to go through, especially for television. Everybody can get a radio license, but not a television license, especially in this dispensation. So once more, Prof, congratulations from all of us in Going Radio. I was yeah. looking at looking for the uh, station manager, but she is not in sight now. But uh, congratulations, thank congratulations. Thank you. Uh, thank you so much. And uh, it's been a very swell moment here. Uh, just like the librarian said, that the room is filled with joy. And uh, it's, it's, it can only be uh, so something that comes from genuine vision. 
walked out with a mission to follow it through. So I'll sing out. Climb every mountain, yeah. Ford <laughs> every stream, follow the rainbow till you find your dreams. Oh Climb every mountain, Ford <laughs> yes. every stream, follow the rainbow till oh, you find yeah. your dreams. Yes, uh, the, the, the station managers here, please. All the love you can give every day of your life for as long as you I don't know the lyrics. <laughs> 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 yeah, thank you so much. Thank you so much. Thank you so much. Thank you so much. Thank you Thank you Vice Chancellor. Yes. Thank you, management team. Thank you, everybody. Thank you. And above all, we say thank you, God. Mm -hmm. And we say to God, thank Oh, Lord, Lord, we are very, very grateful for all you have done for us. Oh, Lord, we are very, very grateful. We are saying thank you, Jesus. Thank you so much. And, um, Thank you so much to Vice Chancellor and uh, the Senior Management Team of the University. Thanks for, Lista, interrupting your duties for a few minutes to be here. Thank you so much and congratulations. Thank you. Alex. And uh, many more, many more uh, uh, groundbreaking uh, news will be coming our way before the end of the year. Sure. Remember, we're heading into October, mm -hmm. the month of many events. Mm -hmm. Yeah. All right. <laughs> so thank you, everybody. Good afternoon. Yeah, yeah. Uh, thank Bye, you so much. Alex. Yeah. Thank, thank you, Alex. Thank you. <laughs> thank you.